Hi, I'm Becky, an artist and instructor at the Bainbridge Island Museum of Art, here with another Art in Action. Today, we'll be making tunnel books. For supplies, we'll be using a ruler and pencil, scissors or a craft knife, a bone folder or table knife, glue or tape, a single sheet of copier paper, and five images. And today I will be using just sheets of color to play with. I've cut my piece of copier paper in half horizontally and I'm going to use both halves to make the spines of my book by creating two eight section accordion folds. So I'll take my first half of the sheet of paper and I'll fold it left to right and open that back up, fold my left edge to the center fold, repeat on the right side, fold my left edge back out, repeat on the right side, turn my paper over, fold the left edge back to the center, repeat on the right side, Turn it back over and fold it in half and you've got an eight section accordion and you will just repeat those folds with the second half of that sheet of copier paper. So I've cut out my color blocks leaving one inch margins on my left and right side and I'm going to take my last page and set that aside because we will not be cutting into that. And then starting with my first page, I am going to cut shapes um, going from larger to smaller um, on each page. Um, yesterday I had the chance to see a painting by Joseph Albers, um, which played with squares and color, and I am going to take inspiration from that and cut out a series of rectangles. Um, so I've measured out my first cut on my first page and, and then I'm going to use that as a guide on my second page to cut, measure and cut out a slightly smaller rectangle. And I'm going to keep repeating this process for the first four pages of my book with smaller rectangles as I go. And remember to leave page five or the last page of your book intact. Okay, so now we are ready to assemble our book. Um, I've taken my two accordion and trimmed them down to the height of my book pages. And then I've placed one so that it opens left to right. And then opposite side, I've taken my other accordion and placed it so it opens right to left. And then starting with the last page of my book, I am going to glue or tape that back page on that very last accordion fold on both sides, placing it directly into the valley fold. And then working back to front, I'm gonna glue each page into the valley folds. And 
Then when we get to our last page, what we'll be doing is gluing it to the very front flaps of our accordion. This will act as our cover. Sheet. And there you have your completed color tunnel book. Uh, this technique is also really fun to play with and experiment with using cutout images um, to give them some degree of depth. Um, or you can play with color and shapes in a different way. Thanks for watching. Feel free to share any work inspired by this project. And until next time, it's art in action.